bring the flame into the stadium. Katrina Webb. Jill Gold Medalist Atlanta. When I was 18, I wasn't expecting to have one of the most challenging yet defining years of my life. You know, life is unpredictable. And through my journey of Yes Challenge and of Yes Change, I learned some really important lessons. The first one was to learn to be me and be authentically me. I always knew I had something wrong, but because you can't really see it, and because I didn't really understand what it was, I just found it easier just to hide. But if you don't know my story um, and you've heard I'm a Paralympian and you don't know why, I bet you've spent the last 10 minutes trying to check me out, trying to work out what, the, what, what is wrong with me. And the reason why I'm a Paralympian is because I have a very mild case of cerebral palsy on my right side. For me, I learnt that it is wonderful to be different. I actually love the fact that I have cerebral palsy. You know, our points of difference should be celebrated, not something that holds us back. And that for me has been the most wonderful thing out of my whole journey. And I realised at that moment, there is a big power for me as an athlete to really help make a difference through others through my sport of journey. You know, have you ever felt that relief to know that there are other people just like you out there? But one of the most incredible things I learned was that negative thoughts aren't wrong or weak, they're just sign of a human mind. And when I was able to let that energy go and live my authentic self, I've been able to empower others. For me, it was actually learning about the power of my mind. I explored more about sports psychology. I had to learn how to focus and prepare my mind for competition. To be honest, if I could tell myself too that at age 39, you would find yourself leading people and taking people across to Nepal as part of my business to the base of Everest. I would never imagine that was going to happen. But you know what, I can be the best with what I've got and that's what's going to make the difference. Because stuff happens in life, but we, the only thing we have control over is how we respond to it. Is there something that you could be holding back or that you're hiding just like I did? And if you could learn to face your weaknesses or your fears, learn some tools to empower your mind, then you too can empower now. And that's where our goal is. Dream big. You know, have those amazing things that you think you can achieve and ask yourself the question, why not instead of why me? Why not?